Long ago, there was a riddle which could be solved by few. Every story starts with a point, but its story starts with two. Two points were joined by the shortest distance. It became linear. It was very simple and straightforward. Let me be very clear. Two points took longer distance by being curvy and bumpy. It became sine or cosine or sometimes even quadratic. It was the base of all the shapes from circle, triangle or a quadrilateral. Let me tell you, it is also artistic. Two points could inform the location of this wonder. It can be identified by an equation or it can be simply plotted on a graph. Let me introduce it in a fraction. All the data can be analyzed. All the growth and progress can be shown. It can represent the intensity of the waves and give us the solutions to the major challenges. Two points could end the story by being a segment. However, two arrows on both the ends can extend the story forever. So, is there still a confusion on figuring out this amazing geometrical shape, which is the foundation of life, yes, indeed, the line. This line has so many problems that can lead to interesting solutions. Hence, making this linear algebra meaningful is very important. But understanding these problems with abstract algebra is truly challenging. Why not find out something that could be very interesting? Let's give embodied experience a chance by creating a touching story with the flavor of dance, a line. Why is your charm so upright? Take the pallet to the ground and hear the sound. Why is it going to? What would you do? I'll bend my knees to take the three levels down. But wait, don't forget to be pallet to the ground. Why is it going to seven? Oh, come on, it's easy. Do I go five steps up to make it seven? Yes, one, two, three, four, five on your toes. Before the drum roll to repeat the pose. Why is it going to five? Set your arms so upright. Why is it going to two? What would you do? Why is it seven? And one, two, three, four, five. Let's go. Move your hands, move your hands. So come on, move your legs, move your legs. Cross your feet and dance on the beach. Let's climb up up the slopes to find the line. What will happen if X equals two? Just raise your arms so up high. Four jumps two steps to the right. If x equals to minus one, calculate the jumps to the left. Yes, it's five. I can't wait for the rest. So, if y is equal to x, two jumps are shown left, up, right, down, just like this. Go. If y is equal to minus x. Just do the opposite. Here we go. If y is equal to mod x, raise both arms high and just turn, watching the sky. 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 Just turn, watching the sky.